Aha! Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Prison Architect. My name is Weasel, and we're playing version 11F. I think that's the current one. It is fully released, and I haven't played the actual architect portion of the game uh, for a while. Last I played was the escape mode, and then I kind of like took a break from Prison Architect, but I'm actually really excited to come back to it after playing Academia. So, my goal for this is we're going to be playing on a medium map. We're going to have events, gangs, weather and temperature. All that stuff is going to be on. And we will be playing a male prison, but we're going to be playing a Safara Akanova. We're going to be like doing like a penny pincher thing where we're going to try to get away with the cheapest things possible or at least save a lot of money, make a lot of money, uh, even if it's maybe not morally completely okay. Um, she can actually sell some stuff of the contraband found, gets like little cuts of that. And um, when they when we find contraband on prisoners, they get fined from their savings, which is nice. All right, here's our map. Let's get this party started. Many things have changed and I might make plenty of mistakes. If you're looking for pro gameplay, you're not going to find it here. All right, let's uh, let's get started with the uh, usual. We're going to be building a hallway. Um, pretty much like this. Uh, we should probably take the grand. The, whoops, sorry, where is it? I think it's over here, bank balance. Basic detention center grand, which somewhat tells us what we need to do. For example, build a holding cell. Sounds good to me. Um, building brick. Did I build concrete there? Well, now I'm building brick. Kind of prefer the look of brick uh, in real life, so why not go for that in my prison? All right, we're gonna need a fairly uh, a decent sized, oops, a decent sized holding cell. I say this, this looks good. Looks like a good size, seven by twelve. This is pretty, pretty big. And we're gonna need a shower that attaches to it. I'm just gonna like swap that over here. Wonderful. And expand this hallway. I'm just just planning this out right now. This is gonna be one big block. And then the canteen. Usually I put that across the aisle, but this time I'm going to put it back there. The canteen. Uh, a three wide hallway. Actually, a four wide hallway. My bad. And then canteen and kitchen go roughly over here. That looks good. And extend the hallway. All right. Now we're going to let our workers build this out while we figure out some other things. Um, bu 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 planning. Planning would have been, been somewhat smart. That's okay. All right. That's going to be our cell. It's going to be our shower next to it. And we're going to have our three wide hallway because we're going to be extending this later. Next, we have a kitchen and our canteen. I think this is a, this is a working layout as so far. Um, I'm gonna have to make sure we are somewhat safe, so I'll extend some fences here. That I think is a good idea. Just put some fence there. I'll just cancel that for now. Whoa, whoa. Maybe another wall in there. Anyway, these guys... Oh, sh damn it! <laughs> oh, well. Accidentally right-clicked. I will be fencing in this little area over here for generators and you name it. All of that good stuff. It'll just be more at the beginning. And we're also going to need a water pumping station. So this is going to be like the outdoor utility area. And in here, it's time to throw some walls down. Okay, now prison is complete without the utilities. So we're going to have to also put down... The electrical cable coming directly from the power station, running down the hallway. I think that should do it, but just to be on the safe side, I'll be running the conduits inside as well. Like this. In somewhat semi-regular interval, uh, intervals. That should cover most of our ground. Oh, you can't access this because you need doors. My bad. All right, for a holding cell, I would like a large jail door. And I also want to put one where the showers are in case we want to close those off. Staff door goes to the back of the kitchen. Same goes with this door over here. And a large jail door for the canteen. Since we don't want our personnel to run for the regular prison past all the prisoners, we will be building a um, hallway that's just for the kitchen staff. At least that would be my idea. And I'll be using this fence to do that. Gonna increase the delivery size. 
This actually goes away and away. This is now being our delivery zone. Should probably put some concrete underneath of it. How much is that? Gravel. What's what's cheaper? Paving stone. Ah, eh, fine. Let's put a concrete. Oh, we can't. That's in inside. I, I forgot. Fine. Gravel. It is. I know. A little bit more on the expensive end. Yeah, let's do concrete tiles. For this, we're not going to need anything right now. And it's time to designate the rooms. We're going to have our holding cell right here. Nice and big enough. Now it tells us what we need. The canteen is over on the left. The kitchen right next to it. You know, as it's supposed to be. Is that not built? Ah, it will be built. Uh, the shower right next to the holding cell. They kind of have to go through here. I don't know if I'm too happy with that. We could probably put a door in between shower and holding cell. Um, to take care of that problem. Nah, let them, let them go through that. And a yard. Oh yeah, right. Yards. Hmm. We're dealing with a yard later. They don't need that right now. They'll be able to deal. Oh boy, I forgot a door. My bad. Gonna need a staff door that goes out here. Alright, while well, my little workers work on fixing up the electric and putting a door on and whatnot, we're going to have to put down more items. I kind of feel we're going to probably need another... Uh, power station soon. Uh, capacitator, my bad. Oh, that's where it comes out. S sm smart move, Weasel. Very smart move. Oh well. Here you go. That that should do the trick. Well, so far I'm not very penny pinching. I do need a good base prison. So, let's make sure that that exists. Alright, holding cell. I'm gonna put down a bench. They can sleep on the floor for all I care. And we absolutely have forgot. Need a toilet in here. Just, just a small uh, toilet. I don't want to give them too much privacy. Just put that brick wall up. That'll be good enough. I'm going to install some shower drains right at the uh, entrance here so that it runs out and doesn't flood the whole hallway. And then we're going to have shower heads on each side of the room. Obviously, we'll have to be hooked up to the small pipes. Uh, where does that exit? I think that doesn't exit on any specific place, so that's fine. And bring the pipe up, and up, and over to the toilet. We're also going to need water connection in the kitchen, so I'll be running this over the electrical cable. And time to set up the kitchen. A small cooker. Is that the right orientation? Yeah, that's the back. Let's see, two cookers, two fridges, and hopefully one sink will do. Ah, oh, that doesn't fit fully. Mmm. Let's cancel these two and put them like that. All right, that's a little bit tight in the kitchen, but what can you do? I also want to give them a window in the kitchen. And they haven't done anything wrong. They're not the criminals, the you know, the cooks. Ah, light. Wonderful. Did you finally build that conduit? Ah, we got our first prisoners arriving. I don't know why this is so dark up there. In 14 hours. Excited. Okay, we can't handle the electricity as of right now. Why, why is this not hooked up? Have you not built the cables yet? Probably not. Oh, that's why you're so slow. You always walk the way around. My bad. My bad. Not a problem. All right, high priority here so we can walk through there quicker. All right, that's starting to look like a little bit of a prison. Um, over here, we have this big open area. I'd like to fence this in if you let me. Just like that. Just one tiny entrance door, if need be. Maybe an outdoor light to make it look a little bit nice, a little bit more uh, welcoming. All right, that's a little bit better. I also want lights out here. It's nice that they're just the, you know, boring old lights you could put on the ceiling, but it, you know, picks whatever it is uh, based on its location now, rather than have two objects. Make sure this is all nice and lighted. Uh, this hallway goes nowhere, I just realized. This hallway has no purpose other than being a hallway. I guess we can put like a cleaning closet in there at one point. Uh, why are you not hooked up? My bad. The pipes also need to go all the way over to this thing. And I guess these, oh yeah, ovens need direct connections and fridges. That shall do. And the only thing I need to build is a canteen and a yard and then hire some people. It shouldn't be too difficult. Canteen just needs some benches and tables and then the uh, food dispensing places. Alright, those are tables. Yes. I think they can still reach that bench. Eh, we'll see. Definitely a little bit on the smaller end. Oh boy. That serving table. That's what you get when you go too small. 
Well, I guess this will have to do. It's a little bit, you know, tight, but it's a small prison. Starting small, getting my bearings again. Oh yeah, we're gonna need another power station, another capacitor to increase the efficiency. Costs a little bit more, but that's quite all right. Okay, so eight prisoners coming in. We can definitely keep them in that holding cell for that time, for the time being. Oh, and you guys have nothing to do. I hope it finish building this up. Thank you. And it wants a yard. They want a yard. How about we build the yard uh, on the opposite side of the canteen? Or down here by the hallway. Oh, you know what? <laughs> nah, that might be a bit too small for a yard. That might be a bit too small. Okay. You know what? This is, this is a perfectly sized yard in my books. Nobody said that the yard needs to be outdoor. That looks weird. I don't know what happened there, but rooms. Where's my yard? There. Little nice indoor yard. See? Good enough. I have no idea what's with these shadows. That's very peculiar. And so that it feels more like a yard, maybe we can put... Uh, no, we can't put grass down. Oh yeah, a metal floor. I don't care that it costs more money, but that is, that is so dire. Oh, that is so depressing, a metal floor. Love it. And, you know, since we're not monsters, we can put a weight bench in there. And maybe a phone so they can make their phone call. Then again, that would make sense in the holding cell, wouldn't it? That's extra money. I can't really earn anything from that. So, nah. They, 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 they'll survive. Okay, now we have to hire some stuff. Two guards. They will take care of the intake and outtake of the prisoners. Sure. Two guards shall do. And then two cooks to handle all this. Is this still not hooked up? I thought I hooked it up. I guess it needs to go over both or all three of them to uh, be considered hooked up. I'm also gonna need a storage room. I don't know if that needs to be inside. I mean, this could be a little storage room. What, 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 what? What, what happened? I, I just hear the weird sound. Sure, let's make this into a little storage room. Tiny, tiny storage room. And put a staff door on there. Ooh, I'm so excited. The inmates are coming, finally. Ah, uh, prisoner intake, 3,600. Uh, bank balance, well, it's pretty high because we have all of those prisoners, money in, money out. So we're still on a plus. I will definitely not go broke. So now that we have finished our first uh, grant, how about another one? Another. Uh, the administration center, yes. Two offices, a warden, and finance for bureaucracy. That's a pretty important one. Uh, I'm going to say this is going to hold... Like 12 prisoners. There's going to be another eight coming. Ah, keep them coming. Keep them coming. We'll, we'll deal with it. We will deal with the, if it's too many. We'll figure it out. For now, eight prisoners sounds good. Uh, normal and minimum. I don't know if I even want minimum. Let's just, nah. I don't want minimum. I want medium. That gives like 500 per. Probably requires a whole, is a whole different animal. Maximum, I'm not touching either. Yeah, here are prisoners. Let's see if they will form a gang. That'd be that'd be really neat. Also, how about right? They get into the uh, delivered like this. They're just gonna sit around. They're not gonna run away. That's good. I would have expect them to run away. That's what I would do. Feed all prisoners. Yeah, you 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 will see about that. Are we making enough meals? It looks like. Looks good. Yeah, we have all the meals. We're running a little low. Wait, is there no? Oh, there's no connection. Need more electrical cables. Figured that would be enough in terms of the distance. Apparently it's not. I don't know how long they reach, how far they reach. I mean, it's electrical cable. It's not a big deal. Just run some extra. Oh, the yard. The yard definitely needs some lights, doesn't it? I mean, I think it doesn't need lights, but it would be a little de depressing. Oh. I removed the fence around this. I just wanted to put gravel down. I didn't know it would replace it. Well then, build the fence again before someone uses this to break out of here. How, how do you guys like it so far? I hope psychologists need it. Right, we're gonna build our two offices. I don't feel offices should be connected to this whole thing in the first place. Garbage. Oh yeah, garbage. We're Definitely gonna need some access to this. I guess they can walk around here. Or we're putting garbage over here. Let's let's do that instead. Garbage. Six by six of garbage. 
And this gives us some room. Maybe we're gonna put offices over here now that we have this. Yeah, that's neat. But I guess it wouldn't be a bad idea to have this all connected to the prison at one point. Because prisoners will have to go, for example, to the psychologist office, I think. If I'm not completely mistaken. Alright, that'll certainly work for me. This is uh, my planned layout for the two offices over here with pathways to the left and the right. Uh, and here I intend to build a special room coming up. But for now, let's just uh, go and make a brick building out of all of this. In the meantime, are you allowed to go out? I don't have a regime yet because we don't have a warden's office. That'll come. No worries about that. I will not forget. About that, I definitely would love a staff door. And we're building a little back path over here with a fence and some gravel, so... Uh, the office here can be entered from the back, basically, without having to go to the main hall. I don't know why that is beneficial, but I just decided it is. It's great. It's the best. Oh, you're removing the walls now? Ah, you're the worst. Just, just the worst. Actually, I want concrete walls around the yard. Concrete is, like, more mind-numbing. Brick has too much texture, and that's unacceptable. Can't, can't have, uh, textured walls. Also, you can hide stuff in textured walls, so that's a bad thing. Same with the holding cell. I just realized having a concrete wall here is better, because I don't want them to hide any stuff in it, and I also want them to go, like, be, be completely bored. Which they hopefully will be. Right, fog of war. I don't even know what's going on in that holding cell without a staffer. Maybe we should hire another staffer to check in on our holding cell. I know they're eating, aren't they? Right, I need deployment. Oh wait, I'm not here. This doesn't sound good. I hear stuff getting broken. Go in there. I think they're making chaos. What is happening? Oh boy. Good that I hired another one. I can just open door, lock open. Great. Are we already having a like, riot? Okay. Right, we don't have cells, individual cells for that. Okay, I think they were complaining because the door was uh, not open. Anyway, this one, this door here, no, not the drain. Give me, give me, give me the large jail door. Lock open. Okay, we're gonna keep those open just in case. Well, I can already see that these guys are gonna be a problem. Oh, you're injured. Oh, medical attention is gonna be needed. Ooh, right. Uh, not a fan of medical attention. To be, to be frank. You kind of got yourself into that mess. I don't want to waste my valuable resources and money on building like a clinic. Anyway, good time to build the offices in here. We're still going to need items and the doors which will be built. Excellent, so our little prison is slowly coming ahead. Slowly working. He's still injured. Well, sucks for you to do heal prisoners. Maybe. Anyway, guys, this is the start of our little prison. Still haven't come up with a name for it. I don't know if the, the Penny Pincher prison doesn't really doesn't really work here. Because I think I already spent more money on it than I needed to. I just like to make it look nice as well. So I'll, I'll come up with, with a name. Maybe in the next one or so. You can leave your ideas in the comments below. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye! Bow. 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 Bow.